Okay. 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 J Real. Okay. Good morning. Uh, How are you? I'm I'm fine. Thank you. Um, <laughs> actually, I um, uh, <clears throat> I'm very familiar uh with with your with your company. Uh, you guys are well. I I wouldn't say you guys are in direct competition with my previous company. I used to drive for. But uh, I'm mm-hmm. sure that you guys probably might be familiar with them, Wooster Motorways. Yes. Yeah. So I I know you guys might not be in direct uh, competition with them, but um, but yeah, I uh, I am definitely uh, familiar with uh, J Rail. But I thought I just uh, you know I, I emailed you uh, some questions that I, that I have uh, that I have. Uh, and I I wanted to uh, I'm I'm glad that you called me so we can uh, go over them. Um, yeah, I so thought be- it would be easier. Yeah, 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 definitely be easier <laughs> to, to to answer them. And I I, I do appreciate uh, I do appreciate that. Um, Absolutely. My name My name's Sean. I'm a six year driver. Been driving for years. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and basically, uh, basically what I'm doing is just uh, just doing my research and. You know, just answering the the right questions to you know put the pieces puzzle pieces together. So, sure. Um, again, thank you for call. Uh, thank you for reaching back out to me. And uh, and I guess my first question off the list would be: Can you tell me a little bit about the company and what you guys have to offer? Absolutely, absolutely. Well, we've been around a long time. I don't know if you. See, heard the background of our company, but it was started by the owner who still is on the day to day with the company, and it started with one truck. Mm-hmm. So, right now, we do have about 400 trucks. Okay. So, it's grown pretty good. We're big enough to know, but small enough to still care because I know the larger companies. I used to work for a larger company, I know. Mm-hmm. Even I was a number in the office. So, it's not just the drivers. When wow. It, when it goes to the larger company, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's just kind of unfortunate. Uh, you know, I got my start with a large company, and unfortunately, you know, we we had one, I guess you can call it a main dispatcher, but unfortunately, if that dispatcher was off or if the, you know, if they was busy or something like that, then somebody else would pick up the phone, and then the first thing they would ask is, well, what's your truck number? Oh, okay. Well, truck number one, two, three. Oh, okay. Well, here you are. Yada yada yada. And then right. you, if you already, if you already preceded a conversation with with your dispatcher or something like that, it's it's like you got to go back and 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 tell the whole story yes. again. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And you know, it 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 kind of get to the point of irritation, and you'd be like. Like, do you guys write this shit down? Excuse my language. I know, yeah. right? Do you guys actually write I've said words. <laughs> All right, so you guys is uh based out of Ohio, uh, right? We are. So as Akron, far as Ohio. So as far as 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 far as a hiring radius, do you guys have a hiring radius or do you guys hire out of the out of the whole 48 states? Well, we don't go west of Texas, so everything Texas and east we do touch, Okay. Um, minus Florida, because we can get you in, but we can't get you back out. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's, um, but, it's, it's like it's, it's like the motel. I don't want to. It's it's hard as hell to check right back out. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> they so. could put her. They could take her money, but they don't want to give it back either. I know, right? That's that's kind of crazy. <laughs> What about uh? What about other places like you know? I I know you guys uh. I know you guys is more of a a regional company. Um, but what about what about what about areas like uh like uh Nevada, Las Vegas? Do you, do you guys get get guys to go up there, or that's only that that's only like uh if they want to do a thirty four up in that area type deal? But usually a thirty four, yeah. Um. We just had a, a driver go up there for his 34th so we can visit his sister. We can get you there. We have a couple loads, but it's not going to be on a weekly basis. I got you. I got you. All right. All right. All right. That's what's up. That's what's up. Um, How much experience uh, do you guys require? Uh, we can go to zero. 
because we do have an apprentice program um, that we teach you how to get your CDO, and then you go to another six weeks training with us as well. Okay, okay. So you guys, uh, so you guys can help drivers get their CDLs. We can. Okay. We just started. Actually, our first class is today. So, oh, okay. we just, yeah, we just got the insurance and everything approved. So our first class is today. Now, is this an in-house class or is this like, you know, you guys uh, partner with, with an outside school or something like that? Nope, this is all in-house. Oh, okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Mm -hmm. uh, with, with that said, um, what would be the, what would be the, um, obligation that they had to fulfill in order for you guys to pay for the license one year all right and if they don't fulfill that contract then what will be the what will be the so what, what happens is every week they get a hundred dollars taken off not out of the check mm -hmm. just taken off of their um their bill for okay. their cdo okay so what it, whenever they quit that's what they owe. Oh, okay. So whatever, so whatever the balance is, that's that's Correct. what they owe. So yes. it's like it's like a contract that you guys have them to sign, but it's more of a uh, financial agreement that they sign as well, like a like a credit card type deal, right? Sure, sure. Okay, so you guys, so if they do decide to leave, you guys wouldn't ball or block their license or anything like that. You just no, say, no, no, here no, you no. go, take your license. If you don't like us, bye. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you, 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 you yeah. just pay you just pay us back our money that we put into you. <laughs> that's right. That's right. You okay. go do you, but we'll do us too. <laughs> that's what's up, man. That's what's up. Um so for uh so for orientation, uh how would you guys get how would you guys get us down there? How long is the orientation and is the pre employment mm -hmm. drug test uh hair follicles or or urine or both? Sorry for that. Nope, for it's part. just urine. Okay. Um, no, no, no. All good. Um, and orientations every Tuesday and Wednesday of every week. So it's two days long. Mm -hmm. You do get paid two hundred dollars a day for that. Um, and it's here in Akron, so we can either bus you. Where, where are you calling from? Cleveland? No, I'm I'm from Cleveland, but don't 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 say no Greyhound, man. You know this COVID going. On. <laughs> right, know. we do. We have done Greyhound, and w because we don't have a like a corporate account with a car rental place, uh, you can rent a car. We will reimburse you when you get here. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Now I'm I'm yeah. good with the rental car. We we can uh, we can yeah. rent, we can rent the car. <laughs> we we good with that. Uh, <laughs> far away people, I've even flown in. So. Okay, that's that's even better. That that's even better. We can we can get uh we can get flown in. That's what's up. Um, <laughs> all right, awesome. Um, what about um? All right, so when uh of course hotel uh will be you know it's Corona, so hotel will be a solo de uh a solo deal for the driver that's coming in. Yeah, it's always solo, e even without the Rona. All right, that's what's up. That's what's up. Um. Uh, what type of benefits do you guys offer? And we do have medical, dental, and vision. Mm -hmm. Our medical is um, Blue Cross Blue Shield. All right. We do have a 401k, which the company does do a half match up mm -hmm. to 4%. All right. Is the uh, medical is the medical half paid or company paid? Uh, no, it's not it's half paid. All right. Uh, back to the experience. What what will be the what will be the pay? So, say like a driver that's coming in through the school, that's coming through the school. A driver that's coming in with maybe a uh, less than five years, and a driver like myself, more than five years. What will be the pay okay. variance? Well, the student part I do not have. Um, I only do experience. Okay. Um, Adam Norman does do the. And anybody with 12 months or less. Okay. Okay. But mine vary because I can do over the road where you pick your time out, you pick your time home. Hmm. And depending on that is when I, how I can pick either a weekly rate pay or a um, mileage. 
All right. So let's say let's say I want to be home, uh, get home Friday, go back out Monday. What would you offer me? Mm -hmm. With how many years? Six. Okay. Now, considering our, ours is all miles and true miles, mm -hmm. and it's not loaded miles or address to address, mm -hmm. whatever they say on the, because that's a big thing with us. Because when people hear my thing, they they hang up on me sometimes. So uh, I'm not going to for do that. <laughs> <laughs> for regional drivers, you can get twelve hundred dollars a week. Or forty nine cents per mile. Right. Now, both both of those are with per di plus per diem. I always say with plus per diem. Is the per diem uh, mandatory, or can we choose to nope. opt out? Nope. You could choose to opt out. All right. So twelve hundred dollars for a week. Uh, is the taxes. So I'm looking at a, a, a nine hundred or so uh, take home versus forty nine cent. If I run about three thousand miles, would give me a little bit more, pretty much. How so? Is the map is is the miles there? I mean, you know, I, I I know I know you supposed to say yeah, we have the miles, but let's be honest, we're not hitting. 3,000 miles a week. So, but is that is the average miles there like between 25 and 28 is is the average yes. miles there? Absolutely. Okay. There's even more if you have the hours. Oh, okay. Just like every company right now, we have more freight than we have drivers. Oh, okay. That's that's what's up. That's what's up. And that's when they got the quote unquote driver, driver shortage or driver want the drive. <laughs> I don't know. They're not making this career sellable any. Not anymore. Not like they used to, but. No, it used to be a great career, an honorable career. Mm -hmm. And they're just downing it lately. And I'm, I'm not sure why. Like, you know, you got a, you know, you got a lot of the old school drivers that's, you know, that's coming up out of the, that's coming up out of the industry now. You know, some of them are retiring. Some of them is just leaving because they just don't like the industry no more. You only got a handful of them that's, that's still in the industry, but not driving as much. And basically what we what the industry is trying to do now is just trying to cater towards the, you know, towards the millennials that's, and majority of them you know is like okay well i don't want to be away from my family uh mm -mm. weeks or months mm -hmm. at a time and you know you 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 just got you, you just got to contend with those people and those the people that you guys gotta that you guys gotta like kind of sweet talk to get into the to get into so but I, some I of them don't want to get their hands dirty and tr trucking is not the cleanest job ever. Yeah, I I agree with you for that. I'm six <laughs> years in the game. I, you, I've been you, doing this eighteen years, and it's changed so much. Man, it sort of breaks my heart. You you know, you know right? Um, mm -hmm. what's the uh what's the equipment that you guys have, and what's they governing that? Uh, absolutely. Now all of our trucks are three years or newer. Mm -hmm. Um, we have Peterbilt, Kenworth, Internationals, and uh, I do know the last one. There's, ah, oh, crap, Karen. Um, I have yet to see a Peterbilt Inter from you guys. I've seen a lot of Internationals, though. Yeah, we do. Yep, they're in there, and we have 10 speeds and automatics. Oh, okay. Now, they are, they are governed at 65 gas, 67 cruise. Ugh. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna have to make do with that. <laughs> driver <laughs> driver facing cameras? No. All right. Uh other than the lanes that uh that, that you did mention, what what are what are other lanes that you guys run? Well, because of what we haul, we do a lot of tires. Mm -hmm. So it can go anywhere from Texas East. Okay. okay. We go from Texas all the way to the water. So now we don't go to New York City much, and I can keep you out of there anyhow. So. Awesome. 
I'm not trying to go up into New York City. But let me ask you no. this. Let me ask you this though. Is there is there any extra pay to go up into New York City though? There is. Oh, there okay. Is. There's about, bridge pay and everything. What what about the north northeast in general? No extra pay, no. Okay. All right. All right. So we do have a five thousand dollars sign on bonus at this time. All right. Um, and it's paid out in ninety days. Oh, ninety days instead of instead mm -hmm. of trying to linger it on, huh? Correct. So at thirty days you get a thousand and at ninety days you'll get the other four thousand. Oh. Okay, this this was up. We just had to we just had to wait that long for it. Awesome. Mm -hmm. no, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> all right. So, how do you guys? Uh, how, how do you now? I, uh, I, you know, I I met a few, you know, a few of your drivers. You know, a couple of them, you know, have their opinions. Of course, do you? How do you retain the drivers that you still have? there what 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 the company try to do to 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 keep them there longer well we have a great um director of drivers tara rail mm -hmm. she is so good with these drivers mm -hmm. um she has flipped over backwards to keep her drivers happy um we do have a retention bonus that we've done throughout covert mm -hmm. um I believe they gave out three thousand dollars per driver last year, in some shape or form. Okay, okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. Well, thank you very much. I definitely appreciate the time. Uh, you Absolutely. know, I you know I have a I have a Facebook group called CDL Truck Careers. Uh, you can go ahead and uh, look that up and uh, join the group if you like. I will go ahead and share this uh good information uh with the group as well as with my social media as a whole and uh and i will keep this in my pocket for myself definitely you know because i'm Absolutely. i'm definitely i'm i'm definitely from ohio and i tend tend to you know tend to be you know tend to want to be more you know uh you know, with an Ohio-based company versus trying to go abroad, because at least with an Ohio-based company, I'm guaranteed to get home. You 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 see where right. I'm going with that? So I I don't think I would have any problem, you know, telling my dispatcher, hey, I I want to be home on Friday. I I don't think I would have a problem with that being that I'm from Ohio, right? No, no, and all all of our drivers are home by Friday if you're regional. Awesome, awesome. Well, J Rail, thank you very much for your time. I really do appreciate it. Um, and like I said before, I will share this out. And um, and yeah. All right, I appreciate you. Not a problem. I appreciate you. You take it easy. You have a great day. You too. Now. <laughs>